Alright, welcome back to Unreal World. I'm still enjoying playing this, and since my last character died, I'm going to roll a new character. And, yeah, hopefully... I wonder what those are. I've never bothered using those. Easy and too easy. But yeah, hopefully this is still interesting to some people. I don't know. Uh, I'm going to call my character Alexi. That's a nice Finnish name. Now, uh, I'm going to pick Seal Tribe this time, I think. Um, yeah, these guys, their main source of daily food is the sea, so they have fishing equipment. I think they max out fishing skill as well. Because, uh, yeah, I'm not going to pick the scenario that lets me have fishing equipment at the start. Uh, let's be a female. Why not? Uh, yes, that's a very attractive female there. I will choose that. We're starting the summer again, uh, but yeah, now I'm going to go off camera and do this thing again. Okay, I'm going to try and avoid the uh, slot machine-like nature of this and just stick with this. It's not perfect. Could do a better eyesight, but uh, it's a decent spread of stats there. And our physique is the smallest, which I think means we need less food. So what do we start with here? Blood stanching prayer, that's to help healing be more successful and help to succeed in making a fire. Uh, both uh, pretty naff rituals that we start off with, but never mind. So our skills, we have terrible agriculture because we are of the seal tribe, I think. Uh, we're pretty good at doing rituals though, actually. It might be worth doing those. Uh, really good at fishing. Uh, we're pretty good at skiing as well. We cannot swim, apparently. That's uh, really not good. Uh, we've got some good dodge skill. I can't increase these, can I? No, unfortunately. Uh, I would like to... <laughs> I'm tempted to increase herb lore after what happened to my last dude, but... Yeah, I think I'll go with cookery. It's usually a good start. Uh, I'll just put a little bit more... Yeah, I would quite like to put a bit more into... Uh, physician, because I think I'm going to get injured at the start. Uh, possibly, anyway. Trapping. Absolutely, abysmally skilled at trapping. That's not good at all. That's how I like to uh, get my food. Well, I guess we'll just put fishing up a little bit more as well. It's already high, but we'll be a novice timber craft. Uh, one more weather law, carpentry. I'll go with carpentry. Are you happy with this? Yes. Random world generation. There we go. Let's have a look at it. Easy now. Right, how do I turn on the things again? There we go. Uh, let's turn that off. Right, so... Yeah, I think some of these guys look a little bit small. I do want to start down by the... Yeah, because it a lot closer than I did last time because I really want to encounter those guys because you know the game's more fun if somebody's out to kill us that isn't a mushroom <laughs> so I'm gonna go randomize my start location until I start okay I accidentally pressed the wrong key and now I have absolutely no idea where I'm starting oh that's not good is it so what I actually want to start with is Runaway Slave. Having been slave to the Yerpazit for years, you finally take a step to escape from your captors. And yeah, this is this is trouble. Select this scenario. Yes. Yes, we will select the scenario. I wonder if I should choose the Advanced Adventures. I mean, I do know how to play the game, except, you know, when it comes to randomly eating poisonous shit. Uh, varying tasks from the more advanced wilderness survival and hunting techniques to encounters of the unreal world in whole the regions near and far, the people of familiar cultures of faraway countries, blah 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 blah. Uh, yeah, why not? I've never played it, so we'll try and make things a bit more interesting. Wait a moment. Blah. Right. Run away, sleeve. Uh, I could have read the story, but, um... Right. Okay, so these are the advanced tasks. Uh, you probably, I mean, if you played the game before, then you've seen maybe the basic tasks on the other mode, but 
I have never seen these, so source of livelihood. Now secure your source of livelihood and gather something to eat for the next few days. Right, so basically we have to use some skills, look at our inventory and eat something. That's not really a big deal, but we are in the middle of a Nyepajet camp. Um, so, yeah. So I think we have actually literally started in a in a camp in the southeast somewhere. So we have a rough knife and some really rough clothes. And that's what we start with. Oop, I'm gonna turn numlock off to use my numpad. Uh oh. Yeah, this dude over here wants to stab me in the face. Let's have a look at him. Aggressive Yerpajit warrior is wearing woolen foot rags, linen trousers, linen tunic. Birch bark cap, fur cloak, and leather leggings. He's carrying a hunting knife and a short sword. So, uh, we want to back away from him. Uh oh. Oh, he's really fast. We gotta run. I'm probably gonna die, like, immediately, but there is a sword over here. So, I'm gonna cry. I'm gonna try and grab that. <coughs> Excuse me. And <laughs> keep running. Because he's probably right behind me. Uh, okay, I think I'm out of the camp. Uh! <laughs> really close. Oh shit. Okay, uh, running backwards is a horrible idea. You should never do it. But if I don't face these guys, they'll just basically get a free shot on me. Oh, I will. Oh, I really want to raid the camp for more stuff. <sighs> Should I try and kill these guys? It's probably a really bad idea. Um, fuck me. Alright, I think we're... Oh god, where did that come from? Oh god, do you have a bow? Uh, hopefully they don't have a bow. Wielding a spear. They may throw that at me, but... Oh shit! Okay, the world turns black and it's... it's <laughs> Uh, we basically just got annihilated. Uh, can I have my sword? Yeah, we got a fucking. Uh, okay, we got a dodge. <laughs> oh god, dodge! Yeah, we're being attacked from behind. Uh, we're basically surrounded now. Okay, wield the short sword. Dodge. 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 You are bleeding. I am dead. <laughs> very, very dead. Yeah, this is me being greedy, actually. Okay. <laughs> you have died. Sorry, I was just reading the combat log internally there. Because I was just kind of flabbergasted by uh, how fast that was. Alright, uh, I think we need to do another attempt at that. And not go back for more stuff next time. Like, getting that sword was lucky enough. Alright, so I'm uh, going through character creation again. I just... I thought this was hilarious. Apparently there's a ritual uh, used to ask permission to sleep at the Supernatural Guardian's area. So, uh... Your sleep will be peaceful and more restful than normally if the Earth Dwellers are pleased with you. <laughs> okay, and we got the blood stanching prayer again as well. Uh, okay. Exit. So, yeah, I picked the Seal Tribe again. Our name is Laika this time. Uh, cookery. Um, I'm pretty good at hide working this time. Uh, da, 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 da. I'll make myself a novice timber crafter again. Good physician again. And carpentry. I think that's what I picked last time, more or less. Uh... So yeah, I don't think it really matters where I actually start this time. So, oh, ah, there we go. But I'll randomize it sort of ish. There we go, southeast, I'll do. Enter and play this world. Yeah, da, 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 where is it? Runaway sleeve. Starting scenario, yes. So I'll pick the advanced thing again, but I mean, yeah, I might just die again. Alright, it's so a Laika of the Seal Tribe. Let's see where exactly you started now. Yeah, get out of the way. Right, that's just telling us we need to open our inventory and eat again. So yeah, there's someone there. 
They, they don't have the sort of, ah, I'm angry at you face thing going on. Uh, I'm going to pick up this rock. Uh-oh, that one does though. Okay, running started. Uh, I'm going to go for this rock. Oh god, am I going to get cornered? Yeah, too much turning, too much turning. Just run. Don't look around. <laughs> so, I managed to get myself some rocks. Uh, nope. Nope. Okay, I'm getting a little bit of ground on them. Okay, the wielding knives and clubs. I don't want those things. There best not be any trees behind me. Yeah, I can basically run until my fatigue runs down. Or I could swim. I don't want to fucking swim. Alright, okay, it's just a tiny pool. Alright, so I think I'm going to face the right way. Okay, we're in a different area. And we're just going to run. I'm not going to turn around. I'm not going to stop for fucking anything. After a while, I will test to see if I can quick travel away from the area. Nope. I'm still on my tail. But yeah, this basically means I start with nothing. I have rocks. That's it. <laughs> I don't even know how to do this. Like, I've never picked this before. So, it's going to be an interesting challenge. Can I leave? I can leave. Can we look at where we are? Right, so we did actually start in our starting position. But there is a Yerpazit camp here as well. Okay, well, I think basically we need to find the villagers. They may be tracking me over the distance. Uh, I can't see them in the distance, though. So we can only assume that we are free for the time being. But yes, at what cost? Oh, what is that? Oh, I can't examine it from here. I think it's a lynx. So yeah, basically I've started with a fine broad knife, though, actually. So I could tan hides with that. That's quite a good tool for that. And trade them for stuff. Oh, it's a fox, actually. Um, yes. I'm going to attempt to throw a rock at it. And fail. Throw a rock. At the body. You fail to send your rock past you and the target. Uh, whatever. <laughs> yeah, I'm absolutely never going to catch up to a fox. So, um, I can't leave. Let me leave, please. What are those things? Novel grasses. Am I still running? Whoops. Yeah, that was silly of me. Basically just racked up a load of fatigue for no reason. Uh, yeah, there's a lot of flat ground. And some forests. These are actually swamps, actually. We are a bit hungry. Um, yeah, i got to find a village somewhere. They are going to be the only way that I have any hope of surviving. I could... I don't know if I can fish with my knife. <laughs> I mean, you could fish with, like, a spear or something, if you were really good at it. I mean, we are of the seal tribe, so, you know. Uh, fishing. Actively fish with our knife. You can't fish with that. Fish with a rock. What? What? <laughs> I, <laughs> I caught a fish with a rock. I, I, I just... I don't even know what to make of that. Well, I've got a pike. Which is a pretty meaty fish. Yeah, we are uh, a skilled fisher. Uh, I can't chop this tree down as far as I know. Can I do it with a rock? Oh, I can do it with my knife, of course. So, okay. Well, we're not completely hopeless then. We'll roast this pike. It'll take a few hours, but yeah. In the meantime, we can have a little bit of a drink. Uh, yeah, that's pretty awesome. So let's have a look at what we can craft, because we're gonna need some tools for stuff. Uh, wooden balls. I can't imagine how long it would take to chop down a full-sized tree with um with a fucking knife. So <laughs> I would quite like to. What about weapons? Stone axe. I think that's what we need, really, isn't it? 
Uh, I could do with a club as well. What do I need for that? Slender trunk and a cutting weapon. I should have saved one of the trunks off that tree. I've got any other baby trees? There's one. Uh, let's chop this down. Because it didn't take too long, actually. So it's just a baby tree. Let's move all these over here. Next to the fire. Okay. Make. Whoops. Oh, I wanted to choose weapons. Uh, club. I don't know how long this is going to take. You are feeling hot. Uh, can I... Yeah, it's going to be burning, but... That's fine. We'll get it before it burns. There we go. It's very tasty and devoured with good appetite. And we still got some left. Very nice. So what did I get there? We got a rough club, which is not fantastic, but... Yeah, we're going to wield this knife anyway. Just in case. And yeah, we can use the club to beat skins and stuff. And I, I wonder, actually, if I can fish with it. If I can fish with a fucking rock. I can. <laughs> oh man. Uh, I didn't catch anything though. That's unlucky. Uh, I don't have a ritual to get fish. Oh, that's so sad. Uh, what time of day is it? It's actually night time, and we're weary. We're just gonna have to sleep next to this fire, I think. I'm getting hungry. See one last bit of this pike, and hopefully, uh, let's push these logs onto this fire. There we go. Nice big fire now. Uh, the rocks seem to have better luck than the club. So, is it gonna catch anything? God damn. Come on, I caught a pike first time and I was just like, hell yeah. But yeah, you can't fish with a knife. I don't think that's right. Didn't manage to catch any fish. Why did you stop so suddenly? That's a bit weird. Uh, let's try again. Eh. Uh, I think we're gonna starve. Tried for four hours. Yeah, I don't have anything left now. This is not good at all. Uh, I'll go try another body of water. Because it could just be... That lake just hardly has any fish in it. What's that noise? What is that noise? Is it just my footsteps? I guess so. <laughs> I don't know what it is. Hmm, okay. Well, I'll go stand over here. This exact spot, for no reason. You should find a better spot. From this location, you can't expect to catch any fish. Uh, okay. <laughs> I picked the wrong spot. What? No, don't go in the water. Uh, yeah, I'm probably just a crowberry shrub, but I think we can... Uh, let's examine crowberries. And see if I can eat these without dying. Herb law. I think that's the skill I want. It is edible. It is completely known to you. Okay, nom 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 nom. Alright, I wonder why I could only harvest that one. Half a week. Half a week, I'll have starved by then. A few days, picked crowberry from. A few days, yeah, I think it might. Seriously, what is that noise? It's very peculiar. Can I fish here? Should find a better spot. I don't really understand why it's saying that. I mean, I'm just next to the water. Maybe it just means there's no fish in the water? Uh, what is here? What is that? Oh, it's a tree. I thought it was a shrub, but it's just the top of a tree. Uh, Alright, well, I guess this lake doesn't have any fish in it. Uh, let's try here. I would quite like to eat, please. And not starve to death. Nope. There's no fish in this lake, as far as I can tell. So, yeah, how far have I traveled? Quite a long way away from that. Yeah, push it. Camp. Uh, is that the, um... Yeah, I think that's the thing marked on the map, the little yellow thing. So I think we want to go north. We might find a settlement to the north. Uh, or a lake. That's good. Uh, please give me fish, lake. 
I quite like fish. Was that something over there? No. Ah, uh, fish. No? Should find a better spot. From this location, you can't expect to catch any fish. Okay, let's just go into the water. Okay. I needed to go into the water for some reason. I'm actually going to starve. Oh, I caught a pike. Yes. Not going to starve yet. Uh, small tree, please. Needs to be chopped down as soon as possible. There we go. Build a fire. Build a fire. Really? Okay, let's... No, I don't have the fire ritual with this character. That was the last one. Cook the pike. Alright, we've got three hours, so we're gonna... Yes, go into the water. Try and fish again. You feel comfortably warm. Right, the pike's ready. Cancel, yes. Where is it? Oh, we have staved off starvation. Yeah, I think we... No, we just only ate a little bit of it. And it's filled our stomach, but our nutrition is still only good. Let's have a drink. And yeah, that's why you don't ever want to get hungry in this game. It's just bad for you. We want abundance... Uh... Nutrition at all times. Well, you do seem to get hungrier quicker if your nutrition is low. It starts to rain. You didn't catch any fish. I'm actually ready to drop as well, so I should probably get out of the water. But, um, yeah. I'm not going to be able to sleep in the rain. You think you saw something in the distance? Eh, I don't think so. But it is morning, so we might as well get up. We might be weary, but we have to fish. That's what we must do. It's deep water there, you need to swim. I wonder if I could fish while I'm swimming. That's probably not a good idea. I have absolutely zero swimming skill. As far as I remember. Yeah, zero. I would drown. Why can't I catch any fish? I'm supposed to be of the seal tribe. Where's my fishing skill? I'm a skilled fisherman. Okay, what do I need? Can I make a fishing rod? I presume I need a cord for it, but... Trapping... It wouldn't be entrapping, would it? Uh, yeah, weapons? <laughs> Surely I can make a fishing rod. Clothes, lumber... Well, I really don't think I can... Uh, paddle, skis... It's not in any of these. Grain flail. I wonder if I could fish with one of those. Just flail the fish out of the water. But no, I'm not catching a damn thing. You can't zoom out while waiting. Yeah, I've just got no fish. I've got to keep trying. As tedious as it is, how survival is at stake. Alright, so I've got another pike. That fire's going to go out. Yeah, I just keep catching, like, a pike. I'm too tired to continue. Yeah, let's go to sleep then. You wake up to the rain. Yeah, I should have built a shelter, but... You know, it just takes too long. I gotta eat, man. I gotta eat this pike. Alright, build a fire. Roast it, but yeah, I just seem to be catching just enough to survive. Which, yeah, you can get stuck in that spiral sometimes. Uh, okay, let's go get some more pike. This is one I escaped captivity for. Uh, smells like the roasted pike is ready. Let's go get it. And devour it. Nom 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 nom. Whoops. Alright, let's get a drink. And continue clubbing fish as we see them swim past us. Didn't manage to catch anything. Uh, you ready yourself to knock down any fish that has approached the coastline. Yeah, this is basically what we're doing. Okay, I'm gonna go find a village. Let's get away from the lake. Because, yeah, I'm just stuck in a fish spiral there. <laughs> I mean, we have a little bit of food. Oh, bloody hell, lakes everywhere. Yeah, we're just in a big swamp at the moment. I don't see any villages. Where are we now? Yeah, we're definitely in this area of... Uh, what are they called? 
It is the Remy, I think. I think it is. I'm not really sure what their deal is, but this is a horrible area to navigate. It really is. Where are you? I wonder if it still uses the same uh, sound effects. What the hell? Uh oh, I hear wolves. That's possibly just a flavor sound effect. But yeah, I was just going to say, it might, I wonder if it uses the same sound effects, even though I'm a female character. I think it probably does. There's just leaks everywhere, what the hell? <laughs> Where are the... They're hungry and extremely tired. Let's just go to sleep. Yeah, we wake up to the rain. Damn it, Finland, stop raining on me. Yeah... Ah, a village. There's also an elk. What do I go for? It's a stag, actually. I'm gonna go for the stag. I'm just gonna run after it and stab it. That's what I'm gonna do, because I'm desperate. <laughs> it might work. And then again, it might kick me in the brain. Oh, it got away. It got very far away. Okay. Well, let's go to the village then, and hopefully they take pity on me. Uh, as in, I'm going to steal from them. <laughs> uh, well, I'll see what they've got anyway. They have a child. I could kill them and eat them, but... Yeah. They tend to frown on that. Where the hell are your houses? Ah, here we go. Well, you got a sheep. So yeah, I mean, they got all this delicious food here, but... You know, they won't just give it to me, pretty much. Um, I mean, what I really want... If I'm going to steal anything, I'm going to steal tools. Because, uh, you know, I can sort of, just sort of, basically provide food for myself. By foraging or fishing, but... Yeah, I'm not going to get any, uh, tools from these guys by the looks of things. But the fact that I found a village is, uh, encouraging. Ooh, some mushrooms over here that look like I know what they are. It is edible. Yellow fingers mushroom. I think it's outside of their village, if it's not. Um, okay. They don't seem to be complaining about it, so I'll just uh, harvest these. Thank you very much. I'll have some edible mushrooms. Yeah, I think we're just outside the village boundary here, so this is awesome. This will, uh... We're actually nourished as well at the moment, so we got 21 of those. Uh, and we just ate a pound of them in one go. <laughs> Which is pretty nuts. Um, yeah, you guys are lame. You don't have any tools for me to steal. So, I'm gonna get out of here. We're gonna go out here, actually. There might be some more of those mushrooms. I'll have a quick look. And if there isn't, we'll go off in search of another village. No, I don't think there's anything here. I wonder if I could pick bark off these trees and just trade that for food. I don't know, it is a it is a valid trade good, I think. Uh, lingonberries can take a while. Nope, alright, so I think I'll cut the video here. We're alive, life is tough and boring, <laughs> but we're alive, and that's something. So I'll see you next time.